Cal, we've got a walker firing on us, and our weapons are down. Is that him? Tell him he better get his butt. Hold on, I'm on my way. Nice work out there, kid. Hey, you got some real moves on you. <laughs> Just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of a Zepho sage. They definitely used the Force. An advanced civilization of Force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zepho journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Kashyyyk, I look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. Then we better get ready for a fight. Oh. I think this lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. I haven't gotten myself killed yet. I'd rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. More than you realize. Well, why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the Purge started and our clone troops turned against us, my Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding. But we didn't last long. Imperial Patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings, but they caught me. And they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but mostly they wanted to know about Cordova and where he went. But you escaped. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No. That's why we can't give up. 
We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. 